Dave's room. Boy, these college dorm rooms are totally dark. What's this on my bed? It's, oh my, oh my god, it's a triple and it's, it's eating me. There's a triple in the room and it's eating my, somebody turn on the qu lights quick. It, oh, oh, it's just a, it's just a present. A present from my good friend B.A. I wonder if it's something geeky. What? Cool, dude! It's a Hirelings Handbook 3rd Edition. I wonder how B.A. knew this is what I wanted. Boy, I wonder if I spend half as much time working on my college homework as I do on this silly role-playing game, I might have even have graduated by now. But there's no point in thinking about alternate realities. Well, might as well get back to work. Let's see, I'll need some some dice and a pencil and a notebook. Yep, all right here, my trusty little pile. Gotta love that pile. Ah, boy. This reminds me of my first hireling. Way back during the legendary quest for the Hand of Vecna. I, I feel a flashback coming on. I'll look out this window to keep myself stable. Okay, you've made it to the final chamber of the Labyrinth of Vectra. You're standing in front of two large bronze doors embossed with Vectra's seal. A stern warning reads, Only those who serve the Duke of Evil shall enter these doors. So, what do you do next? At last, the infamous inner chamber of Vectra. And you say the seal is still intact? Oh, man. I've been waiting a long, long time for this. I cast a bash door spell. A large circular room is revealed with a domed ceiling. In the middle of the room is an altar. Magical flames dance from each corner of the large marble block. Lying in the center of the altar on a velvet pillow is a severed hand. It is adorned with dozens of rings and bracelets. A hand? Then it's true! Brian was right, the legendary hand of Vectra! It's evil! I say we destroy it before it's too late! What? You don't destroy the single most powerful relic in the Hackmaster's GM guide! I slice off my own hand and attack Vectra's hand to the nub. The hand is mine. No way! I'm closer, B.A. I grab my axe and hack off my hand. That artifact is going on this bloody stump right here, bud! Choppity chop! Well... If that's the way it's gonna be, Dave and Brian will have to roll for initiative to see who can hack off their own hand the quickest. Brian gets a plus two bonus for using an axe. Hey, don't forget I'm using my Hackmaster plus twelve. Damn! All I have is a stupid crossbow. Somebody loan me a dagger. You're actually dueling to see who can name themselves first? I won the roll! I won the roll! Dave is still sawing away, but my hand is already lying on the ground! <laughs> Loser! My hand is cut off too. I'm gonna wrestle the big old for it. The hand is mine. Okay, wise guys. Which hand did you each cut off? The right or left? Uh, uh, Brian, which hand is the, the hand of Vectra? Is it the left hand or the right hand? What's wrong, Dave? A little rusty on our knowledge of major artifacts and relics? Um, I cut off my left hand. No, wait! My right. No, oh, the left. Damn, uh, okay. I cut off my right hand. <laughs> you blew it, buddy! Or should I say stubby? I'm afraid that's a lefty on that altar. Brian's right. Dave, the hand is useless to you. Looks like you get the hand, Brian. Wait, I can't let this happen. That hand is an evil relic. Its powers can only be used Wait! to further evil. My character is lawful good and has taken a vow to fight you. Wait! Me. I draw my sword and attempt to stop Brian. Yeah! What in the hell are you doing? You're standing against me? Huh! 
Brian, don't take it personal. I'm just playing my character. If you attach that hand to your stub, you'll become an agent of evil. Ah, Come on, Sarah. We've never raised arms against each other. Step aside. Um, those of you with severed hands lose five hit points per round. I'll back you up, Sarah. Just as soon as I tie off my stub. Psst, psst, hey, B.A. Well, they're fighting and I'm gonna grab the hand. Aha, listen up, numdice. While you were busy chopping off your hands and bickering, I grabbed the hand. Let's play a little game, shall we? It's called Bob's Artifact Auction. The hand goes to the highest bidder. Bidding starts at 5,000 gold pieces. I'll give you 4,000 gold pieces now and I'll throw in my magic cow. Bob, I'll give you 6,000 gold pieces if you destroy it right now. Here's a bed. My fist in your face, Bobby boy. Hand over that hand. Now. Hmm, this is getting interesting. Hmm, I gotta go with Dave's bid. Sorry, sir, but I've always had an eye on that cow. Throw in the diamond-encrusted mahogany yoke and the solid gold bell, and it's a deal, Dave. You got a deal, dude. Will you help me cut off my other hand? Here, use my Hackmaster plus 12. Dave, think about what you're doing. I'm telling you that hand is evil and it will destroy you. I'm warning you, Bob. I want that hand. Give it up. Brian, both of you guys are still bleeding pretty bad. I'm taking Dave's sword and hacking his hand off. Well... Your character isn't proficient with the two-handed sword, Bob, so I'm giving you a minus four modifier. No problem. If I miss the first time, I'll just try again. Easy there, Bob. Make it a clean cut. Oh, I've got to stop this, but I hate attacking my teammates. Hold up, Sarah. I have a plan. Be patient. Damn! I rolled a one! I fumble! Okay. Instead of severing Dave's hand at the wrist, you missed and took off his arm at the shoulder. Dave, you take ten points of damage. You're bleeding profusely, too. You stupid jerk! You did that on purpose! Now what the hell am I gonna do? I got no hands! Dude, relax. I'm picking up Vector's hand and attaching it to your shoulder. It's magical, ain't it? Maybe it'll grow you a new arm, man. Well, do something. I feel exposed here. I can't even wield my Hackmaster plus twelve. I feel another Polaroid moment coming up. You place the hand on Dave's shoulder, and it instantly meshes with his flesh. Uh, sorry, Dave, it, it didn't grow a new arm for you. You now have a hand protruding from your shoulder joint. Uh, sorry, dude, I, I, I meant, well, guess you won't need your sword back, eh? This ain't funny! Come on, man! Fix me! Make it right! Nice try, guys! B.A., I'm taking my axe and hacking that hand off of Dave's body! Not like you can do anything to stop me! <laughs> okay, okay, the healer says he'll give you a group discount. You'll reattach three hands, one arm, and resurrect Bob, all for 10,000 gold pieces. He'll even throw some free incense and some temple literature in. I got dibs on the incense. Well, somebody pay the man. I can't quite get to my coin pouch at the moment. At least I was able to destroy the evil relic before it did any harm. Darn! I really wanted that hand. Maybe we can pursue the rumor about that hand, Vectra! 